Hi everyone, it's me, Paula, and I am very excited to show you guys what I just made. Um, I was inspired by um, so many ladies on YouTube who make beautiful um, dressers. They make dressers out of cardboard, and this took me about two hours and a half to complete it, and I had, and I think I have to add a few more things. But um, I started just with a regular box. It was a regular Comcast box, a huge box about from like here to like all the way over here it was really 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 big so I cut it down and I decided let me go back a little bit to close so I decided to alter it I mean to to cut it up and make a like a um bookshelf not a bookshelf like a dresser and this is what I came up with and I I really 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 love this project and I just gave it I tried to give it my all and this paper Natalie has sent me a paper pad and it is this one here super gorgeous it's called Le Trace Chic Stack and I know you guys probably seen this paper but it's just beautiful with lots of Parisian and lots of glitter and bossing and all of that good stuff so this is the one I used and I made a humongous mess. I mean, a, this is nothing compared to earlier. It was just huge, like mess everywhere. <laughs> but um, what I did is I added the paper to here, and then to make the okay, let me show you like this. So this is, as you can see here, this is the um the closure that I did for it to open up. But I just covered the back is plain. It's just white like this, and so what I did is. I um uh, I covered up the paper and I could see some glue strands right here. <laughs> so I covered up the paper with that pretty um pretty pink and pale yellow. And so I just covered up the front little doors like this and I added a bunch of flowers, butterflies this um Heather gave me. Super cute. Thank you so much, girl. And some um little bobbles. I call them bobbleheads. I don't know why. <laughs> But um, this is just regular flowers from Sock Crafters Trico. Um, so that's the bottom. There's another butterfly. And I just put this lace here. Real pretty. It's a blue. And it matches the top. And this is what I did to the top. This bead here. This strand. It came. I just broke half of it off. And I'm trying to find... And it looks like this. Really, really, really pretty. And yes, my hands are real dirty <laughs> with paint and gesso. Um, but this is so cute. This I bought this at the dollar store. So I bought that one. I also bought it in blue that I have here. And here's my little drawer. And um, so, so I just put that around here, the back, like this. And then I added some flowers. Some of these um head... Some of these marbles that I had made, not the marbles, but I decorated the marble with the paper. I added some stick pins up here, real cute pink stick pins to go with the whole um, theme here. And here I added a, this came from Heather. She had gave me some of these packages and I used a little blue one for with the little glitter. Sorry to make you guys dizzy, I'm going to go down so... For the opening, I just, um, Elena gave me this, and thank you so much, girl, and I just did this little closure here, just to keep it closed, and the inside looks like this, so here I can add little stuff here and here, oh, and for the feet, I just put three big pearls, one here, one here, and the bottom, I will show you guys in a second, and, um, this was very challenging for me. I never um altered anything like this. I never um made any like little shelves or anything like this. So and then I made little drawers down here. I was gonna cover it, but then I, I decided to make to make some drawers. Let me see if I can keep this door open. So um so I just added a little rose here for to pull it out. And it's just a little box that I just made. This is just using the same box that I use to create everything else just the same Comcast box and um, 
Here's the other one. I couldn't put a flower here because it was going to be too bulky and then the door wasn't going to close. So what I did is I just put a piece of ribbon here and that just pulls out like this. Super cute little boxes and so I really really like this. And so that's the end. Oh and these hangers Heather had gave me a while back and they're so cute. These are, um, I can't take it out. Okay, here it goes. Just little um, blue hangers. And I knew as soon as she sent me this, I knew I wanted to make something to um, incorporate this into. So this is where the idea came from. And from watching all of you wonderful ladies, inspired inspirations, and all of that good stuff. So, um, so that's what it looks like. And then I'm going to try to close this here so I can show you guys. And people are going crazy out there. I'm trying to. Okay, here you go. I'm trying to flip it. So um, that's what I did to the bottom. Just added three of these pearl feet. And this box is huge. Look at my hand. It's pretty big. And believe it or not, I didn't do any um, measuring. I just traced and cut because I hate measuring with a passion, and I'm not good at measuring. <laughs> but um, that's what I made. See, it doesn't want to stay. Closed. so that's why I had a little ribbon around here but this is the little handle thingy so that's what I made hopefully you guys like it and get inspired to make one yourselves um thank you so much for watching and have a very blessed day and I will talk to you guys soon bye